Welcome back to Word of the Day with Lance Conrad. Uh, today's word is enervate. Let me tell you a story. The roots for this one are a little tricky, but they paint a great picture of the meaning. Ex meaning out of and nervous meaning sinew. Also the same root word where we get the word nerve, obviously. So if you are out of sinew and nerve, you're weak and drained. So to enervate something or someone is to weaken them, to rob them of strength and vitality. William Randolph Hearst was one of the most influential people of the late 1800s and early 1900s. He ran a newspaper empire that spanned nearly all of America and largely controlled what people knew and thought. He was a man who knew the power of the press. Now, if you're trying to gain power, you're going to make enemies. Hearst's biggest business enemy was Joseph Pulitzer, who ran a competing newspaper. They got into a bitter newspaper war, each one trying to enervate the other. Uh, many of Hearst's friends worried that the war was mostly just enervating his business. Hearst was so caught up in the competition that he was making bad financial decisions that weakened the company, draining it of resources. One of these concerned friends went to Hearst's mother and complained to her about how drastically her son was being enervated. He told her that Hearst was losing a million dollars a year. His mother, however, wasn't too impressed. She, she responded, is he? Then he will only last about 30 years. I hope you enjoyed that word of the day. Uh, if you're wondering how to support me in all this, uh, please take a moment to like and share that video with your friends. Let's keep this thing growing. Now, I've also heard of some teachers who have been using this in their classrooms to help teach vocabulary. To support that, uh, we have created some curriculum uh, to go along with the videos, writing prompts and quizzes, things like that. And those can be found at TeachersPayTeachers.com. Thank you.